and welcome back to the next installment of Persona Q Shadow of the Labyrinth. I learned my lesson. Okay, now let's just get an idea of the path. Damn. There's an FOE here. I see that kanji. Okay, let's get an idea. Okay. So this one goes in a circle. Where do you go? Oh man, how am I gonna get that? Oh, there's a clock on the other side though. I can probably get there. There's a but I need to activate said clock. Shh. There's something suspicious about this wall. Oh, I can still go I'd through. Like to investigate. Oh, sweet. I gimme. found a treasure box. Gimme, gimme. A wealth piece. Damn! There's an FOE Oop. here! Wait, is it gonna come back? Okay, no. Okay. Oh, I'm not gonna do that now because that is because there's a fight that's about to start. Okay, there's a rabbit up ahead. Let's go get that rabbit. There are three enemies. Good luck! This one's weak to ice. Sword type shadow. Ice and lightning. Which we have. Two like cut attacks. Medium chance of sleep. Let's just go regular attack, GA. You. I like you to do a bolt strike. Uh, you have Yagi. <laughs> I, it feels like I forget all this stuff if I don't do it, like, just go for it. Alrighty. <laughs> so, while we're doing this fight, um, I've actually done a couple of things. <laughs> and I'm, I'm a little curious, so my answer's probably gonna come later on. LP. You guys probably not even be able to get a chance to answer my question before that. But I'm curious, because I did a thing. I purchased the... Oh shit, I didn't realize that. Oh. Uh, that's ice, so we can just only... Let's just do physical attacks. Let's do... Let's try Garu, why not? And we want a front row heal. There see? But yeah, like it was to switch um Nanako over. But I looked in like my like my menus, but I couldn't see anything that told me that I where I could change or equip her. I'm get I assume that happens later or something. Well, we'll find out anyway. Rip me. Senkun and Raychon are both paralyzed. They might be stuck. I feel all frizzy. <laughs> me too. Let's just finish them off. Hopefully this will do it. Go guys, go, go, go. Good poison. <laughs> now that it's over, I'm hungry. You're the same as always, Ray. <laughs> Ugh, but yowza, that, that hurt a bit. Oh, but our H HP is good now. In case we should be good to go. Okay, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try to fill as much as I could, just in case. Okay, there's a door there, but, wait, oh, that's where the rabbit is. But I'm gonna check down here really quick, because I see a clock. Hmm, that wall looks kind of, huh. Okay, so that's where that is. That's also another way to the stairs. So that is a good thing to have. I'll pop that in. Meantime, let's go through this let's door. Go! <laughs> Kanji just runs right in. Hmm. 
That's the rabbit and I see stairs. Is there anything else in this room that I don't see? Are those the stairs over there? Of course it went downstairs. What? Uh, well, the stairs are kind of open, Chie. It's not like it can stop from going downstairs, honey. Hmm. Alright, let's see if there's anything around here first. Um... Oh, a fight, definitely. Alright. Hey, yep. that's fighting dirty! Ow! That enemy's weakness is fire! On it. Let's see, do I have any fire? No, I don't. I don't have the fire. But I know someone who does! Use a blast. Do you have any Augie? No. You just go physical. You have Augie. And, uh... Okay, you don't. What made, what, what made me think that Zen had a fire move? Oh, that was the old weapon. That was the old weapon. That's right, that's right, that's right. I'm an idiot. 69. I'm sorry, like, I can't stop- I can't help but hum to this. Alright, so we can just- let's just wail on this son of a bitch. Go, go, go! Oh, come on! <laughs> oh, my God. oh my god, that laugh. Oh, come on now, to level up already. Damn it. You're so close leveling up, you're... The power spot there is active again. Shall we investigate? Give me... Yes. Yes. Gimme, 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 gimme. Okay, there's something here. Booyah! Let's open it up. Ooh, let's equip that. Uh, who doesn't have a thing? You ha you don't have a thing. Oh, you don't have a thing. Oh, that ups the strength. Perfect for a Chie. That's what we want on you, girl. Let's get you more jacked. All right. Eighty-seven percent of this map is pretty much. Alrighty. Well, I know, like, I want to. Jeez, spinning around in circles, touchy controls are my bane, are the bane of my existence. Let's go downstairs. <sighs> oh, this is getting a little bit more warped. Hold on, Zen. It hurts. What hurts? It hurts when you pull on my hand. If you keep doing that, it'll be in no shape to eat donuts. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I didn't notice. Zenkun, don't be so hasty, okay? There are shadows here, too, so we need to proceed a little at a time. We don't have that time. Zen, don't be so mean to Yuki. <laughs> oh, I know he means well. I really do know he means well. <laughs> Poor Zen. <laughs> He's like GA that one time. Oh, here we go. What do you mean? When Yukiko got kidnapped, Chia kept rushing on ahead, no matter how many times we told her to hold up. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Jeez. I was like, girl, you can't do shit. Get back here. We told you to wait with us, but no, she wouldn't. We went after her, but having to worry about both Yukiko and Chie really wore down our nerves. Wow. Oh, come on! I apologize for that! Hey, I understand how you felt. But you gotta keep your cool when mistakes can cost you big, or you could end up losing everything, right? Yeah, you're right about that. You're the impulsive kind, you know? You tend to charge on ahead, which might put people in danger. I believe you should take to heart this idiom, Miss Satonaka. Broske, shut up. <laughs> Paste makes paste. 
she's gonna kick you in the gonads. Or as you've said before, critical hit to the nads. Keep it up, sir. Waste. Oh, you didn't just go with it. You seem pretty cocky for a guy who messes up common sayings. You've got a style all your own when it comes to screwing up. Well, they don't call him the prince for nothing. Yosuke never lets us down when it comes to that. Dude, all I did was flub a line. Why are you giving me all this grief for it? Because you were being a cocky little shit to Chie, that's why. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> it's impressive, Yosuke. <laughs> Cheer up. Paste? Really, bro? Paste. Really? Yeah, yeah, paste. Whatever. Just change the actual idiom to that. <laughs> I love being a dick. Yo-chan! You're a prince? Oh, you mean what Yukiko said about them not calling me the prince for nothing? Yep. I'm known far and wide in our school as a prince. It's true. Yeah. The Prince of Disappointment. Mm-hmm. A total disappointment. A anyways. We're still looking for a way out, right, Zen? That'll go faster with more manpower. Can I just say something here? I meant to say this, like, back in the original, at the first video. I think Yukio's a salt master here because she's really, really good at rubbing salt in the wound. Because... Holy shit! <laughs> I was like, oh, you can feel it. She does with a batting an eye. God damn, Yukiko, you're brutal in this game. <laughs> so don't be so hasty to leave the rest of us behind. Yosuke. What we're trying to say is just take it easy. Yes, I understand. I'll do that. Everyone, listen up. I've got great news. Good news, everyone. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, let's go. Oh, what is it, Risei Chan? Just come to the Velvet Room. Eh? You know how they say, um, seeing is breathing? We'll be waiting for you. It's seeing is believing, not bereaving. Or, oh my god. I almost turned that into a bear pun. I almost turned that into a bear pun. <laughs> Yosuke Senpai and Risei san share some interesting traits. Damn it. <laughs> Go now, Oto. Don't even start. So, looks like we have to hightail it back, I guess. Uh, I'm gonna use a Go Home because. I have like two of these I can blow. Let's do it. And we got to the next floor, so let's see what's going on. Has some great news. <laughs> Head to the velvet room. Oh, there they are. Oh! Hello! Huh? Marie chan? Okay. Okay, I'm actually gonna say a little something here. Um, I've only played Persona 4, and I think Marie is in Golden, if I'm not mistaken, so I don't really know anything about her, other than, like, I've seen her character model, and I've seen, like, her name and such, but I know nothing else about her. So, ugh. <laughs> she might be a little lost on me, so I'm just gonna roll with this. I love her character model, it's so nice. I suddenly found myself here. What's all this about? Not fair that you guys are at this culture festival thing. Of course, she's just suddenly here. This is Marie. It seems some of you already know her. She's staying with us for now as a resident of the Velvet Room. Resident of the Velvet Room? She's not my partner's relative? Oh. Oh. I need to play Golden. <laughs> Someday I'll play Golden. I'm not a resident. I just happen to be here. Where's the nose? 
He disappeared from the car, and when I came to, I was here. It makes no sense. Yeah, what did happen to Igor? Like, I I heard from like a friend that um that like in this game, like they they had him removed because I think like his original voice actor passed away. Someone can confirm or deny that for me in the comment section. So that's why they decide not to include Igor in this game, as far as I'm aware. Or at least that could be one of the reasons behind it. There could be many other reasons, but from what I remember, I think like that's the whole reason why Igor's not in this game. Huh. I do not know why she has come. It may be that she was called here the same as us. In any case, since she is here, let's put her to use. Hmm, we could use secure communication with other worlds. Marie will search for others who are trapped somewhere, just as you are right now. Okay. I'm sure you'll find this helpful. What? I have to do that stuff again? You never told me about that. I'm telling you about it now. When you're not busy with that, why not work on those poems you enjoy? W poems? Th those are just memos I jotted down about the other worlds. And why do you know about them? Aw, cute. Is that so? What a hard worker you are. If that's the case, then I'll ask you to do it this time as well. <sighs> Stupid. Oh! <laughs> Street pass, a function I won't be able to use. Because I am in the boonies where no one in their right mind in this area has a 3DS. <laughs> Oh my god, Street Pass. There's Street Pass in Persona Q. Well, it's a 3DS game, and Nintendo likes to kind of whore out that Street Pass feature. Anyway. What are these poems? They're not poems. They're the screams of my pathos. <sighs> pathos! That donut evaporated in her mouth. Holy shit. Zen! Zen! This pathos is so cool! Is that so? <gasps> what should I do? That donut I just swallowed was tasty! <laughs> oh my god, you inhaled it, darling. Good to hear. Now, considering that you can summon multiple personas, you will soon be in need of fusion. Aha! Finally! I knew pers- I had- I had a feeling that fusions were gonna come in sooner or later. Cause, Jesus, we were starting to hit our limit on personas that we could get. So we can fuse them. Yes! Oh. So, uh... But Igor usually performs them, so I'm guessing Margaret's gonna perform them? Fusion? Fusion is the secret art of using two or more personas to fashion a new one. It is also a cheap tactic to make weak gems stronger. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'll shut up now. The residents of the Velvet Room typically assist our guests with our knowledge of this secret art. It might be said to be the Velvet Room's true function. I summoned you all here because the preparations for it are finally complete. You have followed some strange fate and wandered into this haven in the rift. I have followed it as well. This indicates that I am fated to lend you my assistance. My work will not be on the level of my masters, but henceforth, I will assist you by fusing personas. Thought so. Fusing powerful personas is the best means of strengthening yourselves. If you have trouble in battle, your first solution should be to try new fusions. Okay, so we have the dual spread. You'll require a persona compendium to manage multiple personas. I'll see that you have access to it. Damn all better, because that's what is that's what that freaking book is, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, we got the compendium now. Woo! My duties grow ever more onerous. The nurse's office, equipment shop, and now the velvet room. 
If only someone would come to help. Why do I have a feeling that's a hint, hint, nudge, nudge moment there? Your shop. So now we can use the velvet room. <laughs> Alrighty. And we will look into that, I guess, on the next time because Shabba forgot to put her timer up again. I really should set a timer when I do these recordings, but I don't because I'm a pleb. But I think this was a good progress for this this particular episode. I may do some grinding off screen to get people leveled up. We'll check around that third floor a little bit. I'm gonna try to see if I can fill in the map on the second floor if I can, but I'm not in a hurry to do that. Considering the payoff wasn't as big as I thought it was gonna be. Uh, question to you guys though, um, are there like any particular boxes that have um, like particular drops? Like is it always the same drop or is it like randomized and shit like that? Uh, I am curious, so like, am I able to, like, change? Because I did get, oh, the Velvet Room, so that's the Compendium. Oh, let's, 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 let's fuse one persona, let's fuse one persona. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Oh my god, oh my god! <laughs> Freaking Marie over there. <laughs> okay, Street Pass books? Let's, let's do, let's do a... Let's do a normal, let's do a normal spread. Okay, let's do, let's go, okay, let's go with this one, and we'll fuse it to, whoa, okay, that's, ooh, Sarasvati is a good one to have. Angel is also good, but that one's equipped. Oh, I should probably switch it to this really quick, one sec. Okay. Uh, that one's not equipped right now, but that one also gives the other team. Let's 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 try a set of Zvati. That gives us a Bufu. What is safety prayer? Gather so much safely. Oh, okay. So that's pretty much from power spots. Mm -hmm. That's an interesting thing. Let's go for it. Let's let's. Do you like to pass? Oh, <gasps> we can select. Oh my god! I need this in Persona Four. Oh my god! <laughs> Thank you, Mother of God. You can choose. Holy shit! This is the best thing ever. I'm so hype right now. We're gonna attach an Augie onto you. Cause I don't really like using status effects. The only one I think I might keep on any of my like any of the guys is poison and paralysis. Panic, I don't like it. Sleep, eh. So let's go with Augie. Is this the persona you want? Yes. Now what did the fusion look like? Wait, are there gonna be fusion accidents too? Oh wow. Oh whoa, that is epic looking. That is epic looking. Alright. Let's leave the velvet room for now. I will see you again. And on the next installment, we might do some more Persona Fusions, and then we'll head forward into the third floor of that labyrinth. In the meantime, guys, I'll see y'all in the next installment. This is Shara. Saying bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>